I wish to direct this question to the program implementation director, please. Kanina po, I repeatedly ask you, who causes the delay? What causes the delay? You keep on saying, you prioritize 2022. I wish to ask now, with all the revelations of the Honorable Bongalion, why did you not bother to volunteer these informations? You see, 16 lots were bidded, only two were awarded, the 14 were rebidded. Second, the variance from 24% to 1%. And then the change in officials. These are all material. And the reason for the delay that I asked from you this morning. Why did you not bother to volunteer these informations? Is this another attempt to suppress information? Thank you very much, uh, Your Honor. Ma'am, kanina po nung sumagot ako sa inyo kung bakit na-delay, sinabi ko po yung change of leadership. Binanggit ko po yun. Yung pong pag -strategize. Yes, the change of leadership is a common knowledge mm. from the previous to the current secretary. However, these are material facts which you should have volunteered. When I repeatedly ask you, mm. what causes the delay? Who causes the delay? I this is not simple changes that went through in the Department of Education. Nag-ulit kayo ng bidding? Ibig sabihin, inulit nyo from publication, from step one. Do you understand that? Yes, ma'am. And uh, I'm very sorry kung hindi ko po nabanggit yung... Uh, ang dinuskas ko po kanina ay yung change of leadership and the reconfiguration of the DCP project. Nang ngayon, ma'am, doon sa procurement, tama po yung sinasabi ni, ni Congressman na nagbidding, tapos meron lang pong nanalo ng mga lots, tapos po nagrebid. Kaya din po, binanggit ko din po yung kanina na kailangan Madam Chair, namin mag... if I may interrupt, I wish to manifest my concurrence to the observation of mm -mm. my esteemed colleagues, mm -mm. the Honorable Bongalion, mm -mm. the Honorable Garin, the Honorable Asidre, and even the Honorable Amatong. And I therefore respectfully invoke, Madam Chair, the oversight power of the Congress. Thus, this representation respectfully move for the issuance of subpoena duces tecum in order to require the office concerned to produce all the bidding documents 2022, 2023, 2024, including the acceptance of the end users. And I wish to know also the feedback of the teachers because I surmise na baka itong dineliver ninyong mga computer are not in good condition anymore. I wish to manifest as well, Madam Chair, that if we are able to establish findings based on the documents to be submitted to us, then I recommend that we initiate a separate investigation on this. So move, Madam Chair. We hear a motion, Julie seconded, uh, from the members of this uh, committee to issue a subpoena uh, for all the documents. And by virtue of the oversight function of the uh, committee, there any objection? Hearing none, the motion is carried. Madam Chair, I just wish to manifest that uh, the recommendation to conduct a separate investigation is in order not to compromise the budget process of the Department of Education under the new secretary, uh, with whom I wish to express hope that we will be able to find ways in able to address, to be able to address the delays and the irregularities which we have established through this budget briefing, Madam Chair. Thank you.